Hello, I'm Miles Tails Prower. How lasers are used in compact discs. You know, compact discs, or CDs, is a digital optical disc data storage format that was co-developed by Philips and Sony to store and play digital audio recordings. Other CDs are interactive like gaming, education, and others. Others are for watching movies too. A CD is made from polycarbonate plastic, that is 1.2 mm thick, 120 mm in diameter, and weighs 14 to 33 grams. The CD data is encoded in a spiral track molded into the top of the polycarbonate layer. When the CD spins at around 1000 revolutions per minute, a laser beam reads the CD and is reflected to a sensor, which converts it into electronic data. Sometimes, this can become disk rot, or deteriorating media which system will fail to read data, as disk found under conditions of high heat and humidity. Or, it's an obsolete CD by the way if there is no use. There can be various types of CDs like recordable CDs, rewritable CDs, and read-only memory CDs. Then DVDs began in 1995, that is digital versatile disc. It uses recordable DVDs, rewritable DVDs, and read-only memory DVDs, just like in CDs. Later, the technology unveiled called a Blu-ray, a digital optical disc storage format developed by Sony in 2006, which is dependent on shorter wavelength of blue light. Let's make a difference with the red and the blue light. Red referring to ordinary HD DVD, and blue referring to Blu-ray DVD. Let's give it a closer view of these discs. As you can see, the pits on the disc can read data. When we apply a laser beam on these three discs, you can see three different wavelengths. In a CD, the longest wavelength is 750 nanometers, as you are already familiar with the visible spectrum. The storage capacity is less, and is a lower quality. In an ordinary HD DVD, the wavelength becomes 650 nanometers as it is quite less than the CD wavelength. This is because more number of pits increase, as the storage capacity is larger, and its quality is much better. And in Blu-ray DVD, the wavelength is much less, say 400 nanometers, nearly violet light, more pits will be increased, and can have best quality and large storage. These can help you in finding movie qualities. But the only problem is, one original and the other pirated, according to the copyright law. When you run both the motion pictures, you will notice, which one is not the better quality. The pirated ones which will affect sound and picture quality. That's why the symbol is governed by the FBI, namely anti-piracy warning. That means, under copyright law section 107, unauthorized copying or distribution of the motion pictures is strictly prohibited. That's why people are not allowed to take videos in cinema hall, or sell illegal copies. So, this is a great detail about how lasers are used in compact discs. Like, comment, and subscribe now.